when I tell you guys I've been dying to try this freaking chocolate, I am not playing. I've been wanting to try it for so freaking long and I'm finally about to do it, y'all. Anyways, can we just appreciate how freaking bright this chocolate is? Like, they said bright white and they coming through, y'all. It is bright. And you guys already know I got my silicone cup on deck. I do not play when it comes to melting chocolate and anything else. Because I only use this silicone cup. So I did end up adding more chocolate into the melted one that I had. And when you do that, make sure you mix everything in there together or your chocolate might burn, okay? So please be careful when doing that method. And this chocolate is more on like the thicker side. And make sure before you dip any berries in it that you let it sit for like a cool five to 10 minutes because this chocolate is definitely the one that will give you elephant skin. Damn, look how smooth that came out, you guys. I'm obsessed. So after letting 10 minutes of it just chill, I dipped this beautiful berry in there and it came out perfect. Absolutely love how that looked. And of course, you guys already know, can I drizzle with this? And the answer is fuck yeah, I can. And I did not like the way that video came out looking. So I had to drizzle on the spoon and show you guys. Cause you know, your girl can drizzle. And you guys know I am not a fan of white chocolate, but this is pretty good y'all. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm gonna give it a nine. Bye.